Yes, sir, man. This you got. Can anybody tell me what this is? Yes, sir, man. It's going down. Yes, sir, man. So, as with anybody that's truly into car audio and competing and just enthusiasts in general, I've been contemplating and thinking and debating for years now whether I should get a distortion detector or get one of those new mini compact O-scopes just because. Now, I've got an old scope. It's just the old, big, bulky, tabletop type old scopes. And you know, as with anything, as time and technology progresses, things get smaller and more compact and more convenient. And us enthusiasts get the urge to go out and get it. But, thankfully, your guy waited and held off long enough until this controversy. Enough said about that, I won't re-spark nothing up, but out of the madness came a gem. And this is it. Yes, sir, man. The guy over there at EMF Car Audio turned this all on to this here. Homemade distortion detector. Now, I won't go into the details or nothing like that. That's his business. If y'all want to find out the specifics, go check out his video. Just know that it's your guy, and I'm telling you, man, it's official. Okay. So, now, he told you in his video where to get the supplies and what all you needed. So, like I said, if you want to figure that out, go check out his video. But what I'm going to say for my part of it is I went even more cheaper than him, man. I didn't buy anything aside from the resistors. I won't zoom in on them. I won't show you. I'm not telling you the values. Go check out his video if you want to know. But aside from the resistors, everything else I had laying around the house. Okay? You got your RCA jack. You got your headphone jack, which goes into your speaker. I got scrap wire. And that's what I used. I will zoom in and let y'all see my swatter work. Because, yeah, I do. See guys, 74 Midwest Base, we know about circuit boards and we do minor fixing and repairing and all that. Oh, okay. Get out of here. So, nothing left to do but to go test it out, man. So, as y'all can see, we got our distortion detector plugged into our Bluetooth speaker. And, uh, as instructions states, we'll go up on our volume and watch and listen to our speaker for distortion. I've already done it on this stereo. Our distortion kicks in at 32. We'll get our mic close as we can to the speaker to see if you guys can hear it, man. That's clean. Distortion. Clean. Distortion. Yes, sir, man. EMF Car Audio, man, thank you. Yes, sir, it's your guy. Like I said, man, I got with him. Asked him a few questions because I had some difficulties trying to find them resistors, man. So, 
Man, he responded, got back with me. Pronto is much appreciated, man. EMF Car Audio. Yes, sir, Tube, it's your guy. And we out of there, man. Oh, love.